calcific tendinitis of the shoulder. Calcific tendinitis is a condition that causes the formation of calcium deposits within the tendons of the rotator cuff. These deposits usually about 1 to 2 cm in length. The condition usually occurs in adults around the fourth decade of life and there is a higher occurrence in people who are diabetics. These calcific deposits cause a severe pain in the shoulder which is increased by elevation of the arm above the shoulder or by lying on the shoulder. These deposits affect the function of the rotator cuff and it causes chemical irritation of the shoulder and impingement. These deposits may reduce the space between the rotator cuff and the acromion, leading to subacromial impingement. The calcific deposits are seen on x-ray as lumps or cloudy areas. Ultrasound is more sensitive and actually better than the x-rays in detecting the calcification. What are the stages of calcific tendonitis? Number 1. The pre-calcification stage. The tendon site undergoes cellular changes. Number 2 is the calcific stage. The calcium is excreted from the cells and forms calcium deposits in the tendon. It has two phases. The silent phase, a chalk-like calcification, and the resorptive phase, there are a lot of macrophages, vascular channels, there is a toothpaste-like material under pressure that becomes very painful. The third stage is the post-calcific stage. The calcium deposit starts to disappear, more normal cuff tendon begins to appear. How do you treat calcific tendonitis? Usually anti-inflammatory medication, physiotherapy, cortisone injection, needling and lavage. The deposits are broken up by puncturing the deposits with a needle. You can aspirate the calcific material with a lavage, usually done under fluoroscopy or ultrasound. Surgery at the last resort, when the calcific tendonitis is painful, and usually is done by arthroscopic debridement with or without acromioplasty. All my videos and this video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.